Good day, ladies and gentlemen, and thank you all so much for coming. We would like to share with you some of the innovative commercial products based on virtual reality technology on which our students are working. To give this presentation more appeal, we are going to engage in some role playing. Let's imagine for just a few minutes that you, the audience members, are fabulously wealthy venture capital investors looking to multiply your fortunes by supporting the production of the next generation of VR software. You are going to listen to the presentations and decide which company has the most attractive ideas for the marketplace. At the end of the three presentations, you will decide on your favorite team and vote for the best business plan by a show of hands. Without any further introduction, we will start the product pitches with our first company, Calculet. Good afternoon. We are the proud owners of Calculin, a mass software production company. The educational software market is burgeoning and is estimated to be worth $586 billion by 2021. What about math? What's 8 times 7? Uh, 53, 54, no, 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 it's, it's 56. The memorization of the times tables is one of the most essential foundational skills required for students to advance in math. A widely quoted recent research study in Nature Neuroscience concluded that memorization is a key step along the way to efficient mathematical reasoning. But wait a minute. Isn't discovering and understanding the meaning behind 8 times 7 equals 57 or 6 more important than just memorizing the fact that 8 times 7 equals 56? Memorizing the times tables versus understanding the times tables? Why should we choose between memory and understanding? Can we not just teach both the memorization of math facts and the deeper understanding of what those facts mean? The answer is yes. We can have our cake and eat it too. To combine these two approaches of math fact memorization and math understanding, we have created an innov innovative virtual reality program. These are some examples from our beta version. When a struggling math student downloads our application and inserts his phone into a simple cardboard that is in your special envelopes, he enters a immersive colorful world that he can explore. He encounters characters and guides that are based on the gods of ancient Greek mythology. Therefore, we have named our application DEM, which stands for Deus Ex Mathematica, when translated to English means gods from math. Here's the exciting bit. As a user progresses along their journey, they are confronted with barriers which grow into large walls of blocks. The goal is to analyze these walls of blocks and determine which mathematical equation they model. Once they identify the correct equation, they can continue on their way. And all of this occurs in a virtual reality environment that is both enjoyable and highly motivational. And we know that high levels of motivation will likely translate into higher levels of engagement and understanding. So, for startup funds, we're asking for $10,000 for a 25% share in our company to continue product development from the current beta stage to the full release version, which we anticipate will be released in June this year. Thank you for your attention. If your house was on fire, what are the first belongings you would evacuate? After the baby, of course, and the pet cat. Most of us would probably choose the family photo album. The pictures that chronicle and document our lives are very important to us on so many levels. But let me tell you about the new technology now available to record the important milestones in our lives that is just as momentous as the shift from centuries of painting to the first still photograph captured by Joseph Niepce in 1826. Introducing Hololem. What if you could not just wistfully gaze at a picture of your child's first birthday on the wall, but could actually enter into the picture, so to speak, by participating and interacting with a razor-sharp hologram of your child taking her first step on the same kitchen floor on which it occurred so long ago. You could observe this hologram from any angle and even communicate with it. Welcome to the photography of the future that is now. Have you ever looked at that couch in your living room? and nostalgically remembered your six-year-old 
from so many years ago, curled up with a book, sitting against that same cushion? HoloMem is a company that will translate the beautiful form of your child into a still or animated hologram that can be enjoyed for decades to come while sitting on your no longer empty couch. Those of you who are innovative could capture 19 holograms from the time your youngster was born to age 19 and play all of them at once for his 20th birthday party. <laughs> Wouldn't it be fun to listen to your child screaming as a baby and complaining as a teenager at the same time? <laughs> we can help you create live holograms as well. For example, if you are taking an online course, why not translate a life-size 3D representation of your teacher sitting across from you in your own home rather than watching his face on a monitor? Do you have a business meeting planned? Again, why not set out 20 chairs in your own rec room? You sit in one and let the other 19 be filled with Hollow Mem's virtual bodies, all having a lively discussion with one another. And of course, when we display our pictures on the wall, we usually mount them in frames. Holograms will offer the possibility of new kinds of frames. Here are some examples which Holomem designed and created with our lab's 3D printer and laser cutter. If you are interested in investing in a spirited company with innovative minds that are designing products that will reshape the way we understand photography and education, please consider joining our team with a $20,000 investment for 20% ownership. Thank you. Hello, my name is Liam and I am the co-inventor of the Then and Now Time Travel VR app. At this time, more than one in six Canadians are seniors over the age of 64, which is more than the number of Canadian children under the age of 15. People are not only living longer, but working later as well. In fact, the number of Canadian women who are in their late 60s and still working has more than tripled in the last 15 years. And along with the increasing senior purchasing power, we have astronomical growth in the tech skills of this age group. In the year 2000, less than 10% of seniors were using the internet by surfing or Facebooking, Skyping or blogging. By 2010, this number jumped to 60%, and it continues to grow today with large percentages now owning smartphones. There's a growing window of opportunity for apps that can be targeted at this demographic. Thus, we have created a beta version of the Then and Now Time Travel app. Here's how it works. As the decades fly by, many neighborhoods change substantially. Seniors enjoy reliving old memories of the way those places used to look. The Then and Now VR app is an innovative and emotionally engaging way for those seniors to do just that. So how does Then and Now help seniors relive those neighborhood memories? Well first, the customer sends us the location of a lower mainland area that holds special meaning for them. Then, they either supply us with their own photos of the location, or we scan a large database of historical photos and find the closest matches. After selecting the historical photos from the second step, we then modify the pictures by applying sophisticated 2D to 3D conversion software. We then travel to the lower mainland location, and using a high-resolution 360-degree camera, capture the key parts of the areas as they appear today. We then display the old and new versions of the neighborhood using our Then and Now app, which they can download to their smartphones in either traditional photo format or in that of an immersive 3D VR experience that can be displayed on the cardboard or Gear VR viewer. So, we are asking you to consider investing in using the technology of the future to make the past come alive. We are requesting for startup funds of $10,000 with a 25% share in our company to continue product development from our current beta version to the full version, which we anticipate will be released in June of this year. Thank you for your kind consideration.